One of the less pleasant things about portable QRP is untangling antenna wires. Here's the conventional approach, just making a big coil and not crossing the wire over itself. It looks nice and neat like this, but as soon as you chuck it on the ground, it tangles. Knots almost seem to instantly appear. And even as you undo them, you might be creating even more knots. A posting by WB6BYU suggested another approach. Instead of winding like this, you would wind in a figure eight pattern, crossing with every turn. I don't think even the best way of winding wire so it doesn't get tangled is going to save me from tangling it. However, I do think the approach suggested by WB6BYU is a lot better than just the plain old winding like that. Even where there are tangles, I've noticed the tangles seem to be isolated to a small section of wire. And we're soon back down to single wire. That means more tangles are isolated and it's quicker to undo them. Just to recap, every time you need to wind wire back on your arm, always cross it in a figure eight fashion. It will save you time. Happy 2016 and VK3YE.com is back online. If you haven't yet got what everyone's now reading, check out Minimum QRP. Just visit Amazon and search Minimum QRP. Or click on the banner at VK3YE.com.